How important is it to hire a non-LDS African-American coach on the BYU roster? This is a critical question right now because you have Kalani Sitake, who was a minority, right? A, a Tongan, first Tongan head coach in college football. Um, he's made, I believe, efforts to hire individuals that are non-LDS and in minorities, right? Uh, you know, I have a license to Iaki, who's a minority, but is LDS. Janelle Guilford is non-LDS African-American that has ties to BYU, obviously. Uh, you have Preston Hadley, minority, but is LDS, pretty diverse. Um, you go down the, the list, Aaron Roderick, LDS, uh, and Caucasian, right? So it's diverse. Ed Lamb, Caucasian, but not LDS, but very much aware of the LDS and Mormon culture. It is a diverse, one of the most diverse uh, BYU men's football coaching staff rosters that we've seen.